as well. And one reason we know more about what's going on in the rivers now is that us is testing three times a week uh, on 40 river miles from US 41 North Augusta Road all the way to the state line. Um, a little faster. Publishing information would be appreciated, but <clears throat> yeah, we get about half of it on almost instantly, and then the other half is is, is days later. We'll, we'll work on that. Yeah, it's a contractor, but you know, your guys that employ the contractor. Oh, we sure can. We pay them big. I think eighty thousand dollars a year now. Eighty thousand dollars. <laughs> Sorry to be that transparent, but that's that's exactly what the and that's by consent. I agree. That's it. Well, that's quite a markup because I know what they're. If they're using the same kind of labs we are, and they would be paid, they pay the labs anyway. But uh, the point I was working up to is we're constantly after the state of Florida. We're saying if Valdosta can do this on 40 river miles to the state line, the great state of Florida should be able to do this the rest of the way, all the way to the Gulf on all the rivers in the Swanee River Basin. Well, I'll give you a little insight into that too after the break, and you'll stay around. We'll take a quick break. We'll come back. More discussion on our area of blueways. We want them to be just that. We want them to be a tourist destination and available for every resident here who does not know how to put a boat on the water. That's that's a lot of us. We're talking 92.1.